Hello, my name is Dr. Brian Schmavsky, and I'm a professor of environmental sciences at Lone Star College, Kingwood. And I've been serving as an evaluator for the Civic Science Inquiry into Action program that is run by SELF. As a practicing environmental scientist who also teaches, what's important about this project is um, engaging students in civic service, particularly related to environmental issues. And particularly, we're finding out that at middle school, high school level, this is a time where we need to capture students' interest in science and teach them how to apply science, and particularly so for students that are underserved, like a lot of the students that I teach, because they have a, an acute awareness of their environment and they really don't know what to do about it. So this program, this, this project gave the students the tools to be able to be heard. And the biggest part of that is literally collecting data, making things real, measurable, and that is such an important workforce skill. And what's important about this project, and, and really the finest point, is here's my data, I know how to communicate it, the data's good, and I can answer questions on this, and I can extrapolate. And some of the students even looked at other scenarios. How could I apply this to water? How could we now clean this up? And that was the neatest thing to see where students were now researching, can we clean this up in an inexpensive, sustainable way? And they really use the term sustainable as much as that in a way that we could afford and that anybody can do. I grew up in an environmental justice situation in New York City housing projects. And I know we didn't have programs like that as a kid. So we just lived with the pollution. We had a lot of anger. We had a lot of we could do nothing about it attitude. And even if we thought about there was something we can do, we knew our voices would be heard. This project gave the students the tools to be able to be heard. The teachers and students that I talked to during the evaluation process, they were talking about continuing this and they were forming collaborations with each other and even wanted to spread this throughout their schools or to other schools within their district. And that to me is success. And I've seen lots of teach workshops take place. And this one just had so much added value. A project like this gives hope, particularly in science teaching, that science has a use. Science can be used for good. And science can be accessible to people to use for good. All people.